Hey, let me show you about our faux shelves and our solid shelves. So some of the main benefits of the hollow or faux shelves as seen behind me here is they're lightweight and easy to install. You can customize them by making them whatever thickness and depth you want as well as color. Uh, you can choose different textures and whether you want saw marks. These are shown in our Swedish sanding so it's smooth, level, corners and edges are clean and square and this does not have saw marks on it and these ones are shown in black charcoal. If you're measuring your faux shelves to be open like these ones you will order them with finished ends. You can see on both sides of this that it has finished ends. If it's in more of a cubby, let's say you have a fireplace here and a wall here, then you don't need finished ends on it. So if you're ordering a faux shelf like this one, there's a couple of choices for mounting brackets. One is a wooden cleat and one is a finger bracket. This is done with a wooden cleat. If your faux shelf is eight inches deep or smaller, you can get away with a wooden cleat. Really easy to install. You can see here it's an inch and a half by three quarters of an inch thick. You can see here it fits in the back of the shelf. It's slotted out for it. And the shelf basically just slides right over that. Then it will have a little bit of movement like this. If you order the finger brackets, even for the narrower shelves, like eight inches and shorter, you won't get as much uh, movement like this, but an easy way to solve that is just to pin it. So for pinning it or fastening it so it doesn't have movement up or down, we use these wonderful little headless screws, or you can use a brad nail. Basically, you hold this tight to the wall, and you'd put, a, you'd put a couple of brad nails in, and it'll be good to go. So these are our finger brackets. They basically mount to the wall as well, and then your faux shelves just slide right on over these. So behind me here are our solid shelves. Some of the beautiful parts about a solid shelf is it is solid. Another benefit is, is that it shows a little more character and they're a little more stable. So behind me here are solid shelves. These ones are shown in an inch and a half thick. You can also get two inches thick and three inches thick. For depths with a solid shelf, if you want them floating like this, don't go any deeper than 10 inches. If you're going wall to wall, just let us know that. If you order on the website, right under special instructions, say wall to wall, and then give us that dimension. And uh, we can provide the proper cleating and mounting brackets for you. If you're gonna have it floating like this, then we can use our solid domino brackets, which I'll show you in a minute. So here's our solid shelf, and we left this unstained to show you where the dominoes are. They stand out a little bit more. So you can see this one here, they're grooved into the back. This part of the shelf is fastened to the wall, and you can pre-drill into your studs. You can see the little fingers on here, and this basically just slides on over. Thanks a lot for watching our video. You can check out all of our pieces on our website, or you can come on into our studio here in Morden. Thank you so much.